Let's go. I just want to thank a lot of people. Bruh. I'm. Oh, fuck it. Back. Fuck it. I'm gonna exit this way. Okay, so today we're gonna try a little bit different for lunch. We're gonna try the peanut butter broccoli ramen. Uh, first of all, we got the soup packet, which I don't know if it'll mix well with the peanut butter, but who cares? There's only one way to find out. This is like plain broth, so it's probably fine. I don't know. All right, a spoonful of crunchy peanut butter. This feels so wrong. <laughs> what the fuck am I making? Chopped up some very old broccoli. Hopefully they taste fine. Okay. I feel like I'm, I'm going to need to give it a mix. And then, afterwards, we need to put the noodles there. All right, let's try this. Peanut butter, broccoli. I also added some sesame oil on top. <laughs> let's hope it's good. I probably put too much water. All right, let's try it. Honestly, I don't even taste the peanut butter. I don't even taste it. I mean, there's a little bit of it, but like, it's all lost in the soup. Alright, hey guys, what's up? It's the Culture Detective here, investigating your favorite movies. And today is a really special day because it's November 27th, which literally means nothing. But today I'm going to be uh, going somewhere that is um, quite interesting. And that is the Academy Museum which is in West Hollywood, I believe. I don't know, I'm walking to the bus stop right now. And um, aside from that, the main course of today is to really to watch Bernardo Bertolucci's The Last Emperor um, on a big screen. And joining with me today would be my Chinese friend Leslie and my Malaysian friends Cliff and Justin. Um, so, um, supposedly my friend Pepper would also join, but she's busy, so she declined today, unfortunately. So yeah, here we go. The Academy Museum, here I come. That was a cop car. Never been here before. What a wide road. Whoa. What the heck is this place? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> There's like no one here. <laughs> Very interesting. There we go. All right, the Academy Museum. Except I'm going to uh, a parking spot called the Valet Parking Place for the entrance. I don't really know where that is, but I'm gonna find out. 
Fuck. All right. Where's the parking spot? Is that it? I think that's it. All right, got confused for a moment. Apparently we need to walk into the thing. So I, I've walked in. Where, where are they? Hmm. Neither Cliff and, and Leslie are like responding to me. Like they have disappeared. Oh boy, where, where am I supposed to go? What the heck? Where am I supposed to go? What the fuck? Where the fuck am I supposed to go? What the fuck? I still can't find any of them. I don't know what's going on. Okay, where the fuck am I? Are they inside the building? They better be fucking inside the building. They better be fucking inside the building. Holy fuck. Okay. All right. They're they're both here. Yes. Hey, I got the Bruce Lee poster. <laughs> Is this a notebook? Oh yeah, there's nothing inside. Okay. <laughs> Chocolate factory. Movies, 300 word. Oh, okay, I, I see what's this. I see what's going on. Fucking spoiler alert. <laughs> funny, very funny. Why does this pin even exist? Oh, because of the, the blue. The blue. Bro. But there's, there's the normal one, I think, down there. Yeah, this one. Which one? Oh, that's it. C47. Ah, yes. This shirt definitely fits me. Oh, what the heck is this? The Spirited Away box. What's the Yeah, I mean, by ranking, Spirited Away. I want to watch that one. Oh, my favorite is Princess Mononoke. Me too. So. Oh, this might be good. This might be better than the pin. Oh, goddamn. I want to get this. Sample. Oh. But it's so cool. Oh, look at this. I have a whole thing for this. Oh, but it's gonna. Sh All right. Got gifts. Even, even though we technically can't get tickets, we can now because magic. Thank you. Okay. 
We're just gonna speed run the museum. It's fine though, I'm good at speed running. <laughs> Alice Ski. <laughs> I don't think there's anything like to see on the fifth floor. I think it's just this. The the Barbara Streisand Bridge. Oh. Oh it's actually um Oh the one by the Yeah. Ooh. Oh, that the boulder. Ooh, it's there's a art. Hollywood sign. Oh, yeah. yeah it's an art. It's an art piece. <laughs> I've never met my father since I've been there. I've worked with someone else. That's not, yeah. It's <laughs> not. Right, go get it the Oh my god, it's Ohio! It's Ohio! <laughs> This is the this is the whole room. <laughs> you can see the pixels. I like this. This is British people when they get mad. Pedro Almodovar. <laughs> oh my god. No. I should have, but I forgot. Damn. It was kind of like a yeah, he needs to get out of the college. He needs to get. He did the moon movie, right? Yeah. Oh, a, a trip. To yeah, a trip to the moon. Yeah. Do this Terminator, Terminator Two. This Edward scissor hands. Oh yeah. Oh 
What is this? When entering, use your eyes time. Allow your eyes time to adjust. Dolby Atmos experience? Where is it? Oh, it's down. It's inside. There's a Yojimbo. Ladies first. Oh. Black girl? Roma? I don't know this film. Oh, that's the uh, frigging Apu trilogy? Joan of Arc? Get out. We're just naming a movie. Breathless. That's Breathless. That's the Clint Eastwood film. That's Persona? I don't know. <laughs> That's Blade Runner. No, there's Yojimbo. Finally, Citizen Kane. Oh, there's Bruce Lee. Hey, yo. This brother, thank you, Bruce Lee. Oh, that's close up. That's uh, Abbas Karostami's close up from Iran. Yo! Yo! <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, we just spot. We're just spotting movies. Bill Murray. I don't know what movie is this. Yeah. <laughs> Lens, bro. <laughs> okay. Wait, there's a. Oh. We're gonna watch this first, by the way. I want to see that room though. Oh boy, they're gone. What is this room? Let's go. I just want to thank a lot of people. I, uh, to tell you the truth, I didn't prepare for this speech. But... I just saw that film yesterday. for blood and blood out of me and one of the characters had a rose tattoo play. So we are from
Parasite? Uh, Parasite? Uh, Parasite? Uh, Parasite? Uh, like, what is what is this movie? <laughs> Oh my god, all the Instagrammers, all the Instagrammers are here. Alright, I'll return someday with the Sony camera and it's gonna be good, but not today. Alright. We're going to eat dinner at the McDonald's. Honestly, continue. Oh, I don't want to eat anything, honestly. I just want to drink something. Oh, let's get something simple. Paleo fish? And like other places, like the shape of the pie. Yeah, yeah, in other, in Hong Kong, it's just a red, like a red piece of paper, oh, yeah, like this. Ours is Double cheeseburger, it's like this, mango like a smoothie. Box, it's a shit. To worsen my cough. Yeah, I didn't have a I really good dollar for like five dollars. Five dollars? You know Justin's nine hundred and sixty? Yeah, right? but but he, he rented it before. Bruh. I'm fuck it, fuck it, I'm gonna exit this way. Wait, how do I even exit this place? Fuck. You know it would be funny if you bring your, your Italian friend. If you bring Chiara. Because, because this right film now, is fight with her. really next to you, we are gonna have a full house. Oh, because this Ooh, damn. Also Pepper is here. Hello, good evening. Hi. Yeah. There we go. Welcome everyone to the Academy Museum of Motion Pictures. This is the largest institution in the U.S. devoted to the arts, sciences, and artists of movie making. My name is KJ. Applause for that. <laughs> when I went to attend the show, and um, I really wanted to play the Year of the Dragon, play the lead. First one or second one? Big button. In the film, what what do we? Oh, it's actually it smells sweet. Wait, what's it's that? It's very flavor? sweet. That, that one is a Can you smoke? I never see you smoke. <laughs> Damn. It's actually very sweet. It's good, right? This is my. It's like. Yeah. All right, so time now is uh, 12.08 after midnight. I just came back home. Um, I'm going to conclude this video as quick as possible. I have a lot to say. I have a lot of thoughts and feelings, but I'm going to talk about that in my personal vlog videos. But I'm going to quickly summarize what happened today. So what you just saw was uh, me going to the Academy Museum, meeting up with Leslie, the Chinese girl, and Cliff the Malaysian boy. Apparently he's only 19 years old and he's younger than me and I'm and apparently I'm older of the three. What the fuck? We shopped at the oh is my nose bleeding? We shopped at the store a little bit and I got a couple of um souvenirs at the end. Um one is the uh spirited away rice box <coughs> and the other is um a magnet with the poster of a woman on the verge of a nervous breakdown on it. I was going to get a pin, but it's just not going to be very useful for me. 
Neither is the magnet useful, but at least it's a cool magnet. It's a cool poster, it's a cool magnet. What can I say? <coughs> Next thing you know, uh, we got into the museum itself. Uh, we almost didn't get in because by then it was 4.38 p.m. And we are eight minutes late in terms of buying the ticket. But there was a nice guy and he's like, okay, we're going to give you tickets in the back, in the back end, in the down low. Because we see that you bought some of our stuff. So, you know, we're good people. Okay. So we actually got in and we, and we basically speed ran the entire museum. Um, there isn't that much to see, honestly. Um, nothing all that crazy interesting. There's a Bruce Lee exhibition, but of course, if you want to see a good Bruce Lee exhibition, go to the cultural museum in Hong Kong. Go to the culture museum in Hong Kong, in Sha Tin. That one has an even cooler Bruce Lee museum exhibition than the Academy Museum. I'm kind of disappointed there isn't a Miyazaki exhibition. That would have been the highlight of the day for me, but unfortunately there isn't one. Um, so there's that. Afterwards, we went to McDonald's for dinner because literally every other restaurant nearby is extremely expensive. Hey, we're in West Hollywood, okay? Everybody here are Jeff Bezos or something. After that, we um, actually before that, we went to check out the column stuff, which is a huge hot spot for Instagram. It's right outside LACMA, aka uh, Los Angeles Contemporary uh, Museum of Art. Los Angeles City Museum? I, I, I don't know. Los Angeles County Museum of Art. <coughs> I really wish to go there someday um, because there are some amazing paintings that I need, really need to see uh, with my naked eye. Um, anyways, um, Pepper joined us, uh, surprisingly. I thought Pepper will not show up today at all, but Pepper did, which is awesome. And then we went to the theater, and then Pepper uh, bought a ticket, um, queued up, bought a ticket, and we went in to watch a movie. There's a, about 30 minutes of Q&A with Joan Chen, the one and only Joan Chen. You may know her from Twin Peaks. And Lisa Liu, who also showed up, um, who also played the Empress Dowager in the Shaw Brothers film in 1975. Haven't seen it, but I would really love to. Um, and uh, <coughs> and then the movie begins, and it's all right. I'm a little bit... I like the movie overall, but there are some parts that really prevented this movie to be a 9 out of 10, or even a decent 8. I would say this movie is a light 8 for me. Um, but it does look amazing, and I'm happy I get to see Vittorio Storaro's work on a big screen. It's very rewarding. Afterwards, it is, it's 11 p.m., and we decided to take an Uber ride together. Pepper called an Uber, and we all sat on it. Before that, while we were waiting for the Uber, um, I decided to top the day off, you know, really cherry on top, by uh, vaping for the first time in my life. So you know what? Fuck it. I'm here in L.A., Okay. And I've done so many things for the first time in my life. I've tried Taco Bell the first time. I saw snow for the first time. I got COVID for the first time in my life. Might as well vape. Because I've already broken a lot of records. Another record breaking means nothing. And Leslie said um, it's like 5% nicotine. It's only 5%. So it's like nothing, right? It's fine. And I'm sure I've probably consumed foods that has more nicotine content than this. I've probably consumed secondhand smoke back in the streets of Hong Kong that had more nicotine content than this. This is probably nothing. So I actually tried it. Um, <coughs> and it's, um, yeah, it's, it's not bad. I wouldn't be addicted to it because I have, my personality is the kind of personality that wouldn't be addicted to something easily. Obviously, given my history of not having any romantic relationships or crushes, um, I'm not the kind of person who gets addicted to things. So um, it's it's fine though. It it's basically to me, I feel like this is um, it. It feels like the gas state of chewing gum. It's minty. It's very sweet, and I don't really taste the smokiness either though after uh exhaling the smoke which is quite strong and dense actually i coughed a little bit and there's a bit of nicotine um i don't know if it's nicotine or not but there's a bit of an aftertaste in my throat a bit of a scorch 
but just a tiny bit nothing nothing crazy and i am still um alive now so that's that because i saw pepper also vaping and i'm like what the fuck you vape to and i was almost peer pressured into it but i make sure it's on my own accord because pepper when pepper saw me vape she was like what are you really gonna do it yes yes i am yes i am so culture detective signing off um it's it's been a um, fun day it started off today started off a little weary but it's it's it ended off quite nice actually okay i'm gonna talk more about everything that just happened in detail in my vlogs if you don't know where to find my vlogs good